We must realize that no arsenal or no weapon in the arsenals of the world is so formidable as the will and moral courage of free men and women. It is a weapon our adversaries in today's world do not have. Let that be understood by those who practice terrorism and prey upon their neighbors. Some U.S. intelligence analysts believe America is already in a state of war with the Soviet Union. Are Soviet spies living among us? 52 American citizens have been taken hostage at the American Embassy in Tehran. An unnamed White House official claims that a Cold War disaster could be just around the corner. Mr. President, we have two names linked to the hostage situation. Arash Kadavar and Kasim Javadi. Just give the word. It's time to send a message. There will be no more hostages. You sure we can trust the police, Adler? This guy's done more for less. He'll look the other way. Adler? Glad you could join us, Hans. You remember Mason. We cleared a move on the target. Kasim is in his apartment, but he's well protected. Can keep my men out of the area for 15 minutes. I hope you brought an army. We brought enough. Pleasure doing business with you, Hans. Come on. Woods is itching for a dust stop. We don't want to let him down. We're on the clock, Woods. Let's not keep the scene waiting. Hey, mate. Party favors are in the trunk. Dipshit probably thinks he's safe. That piece of trash is a lot of things. It's safe ain't one of them. Do we really need to take this son of a bitch alive, Adler? Kasim has info we need. Everyone else can take a powder. The apartment's just up ahead. Hans only bought us 15 minutes. We need to hit Kasim hard and fast. Let's go. Let's help him ring in the new year. Light him up, Mason. Go, go, go! There's Kasim! Kasim's headed up the stairs! We need Kasim alive! I'm out on more Kasim can't escape! Find him! Moving! Move! 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 He's 
Bolt in! Keep on him! Jesus, this guy's fast! Go, go! Hurry up! <laughs> Nowhere left to run, Cassie. We can work so hard! You're up, Mason. Wait, wait, wait! Oh, wait, wait! I, I, I just handled the money? I have no idea where Arashi is. I don't think you understand the situation. Uh, you, you Americans have rules? You have rules! You took hostages. The rules changed. Wait, wait, wait. He's in Turkey. He's meeting someone in Trap Zone Airfield tomorrow night. Oh, oh, I swear, I swear I don't know. They only communicate with coded messages. This is not... Oh. All right, let's load him up. We'll find his voice soon enough. Let me know if he needs him. Kasim is out of the picture. How long before we get Arash? The team arrived in Turkey a few hours ago. They should be in position shortly. Airfield's just up ahead. Let's go find this shithead. Priority is to ID a Raj before things go hot.
Perseus is dead. Dead? <laughs> All this time and you didn't even know. <laughs> Perseus will watch the web. Hudson will want to hear about this. Let's sweep the tarmac for survivors and get to Langley. Who the fuck is Perseus? 1943. Detailed information from the Manhattan Project was stolen from Los Alamos by the Russian spy known as Perseus. 1968. Vietnam War. Viet Cong soldiers orchestrated by Perseus attempted to steal an American-made nuclear bomb from a U.S. firebase. Five days ago, while on a mission, we acquired intel that Perseus is in play again planning an attack on the West. Perseus. The CIA's analysts consider him to be the single largest threat to the free world. Mr. Hudson, we're all aware of Perseus. We're also aware he's more myth than fact. I mean, personally, I think he's nothing more than the Russian boogeyman. General Haig, allow me to introduce the man I suited to respond to that. CIA clandestine special officer Russell Adler. He's one of the few people who even come close to capturing Perseus. Uh, Mr. Adler, why should we take this Perseus threat seriously? You don't have to, sir. <laughs> yeah, then a lot of innocent people are gonna die. Why do you say that? Sir, every time Perseus has come into play, it's shifted the balance of the Cold War. After 13 years of silence, if he's active, something big is gonna happen. Something that will affect the free world. Sir, sir, Mr. President, sir, Mr. President, Mr. President, this is Jason Hudson and Russell Adams. I know their names. Who do you think approved their last mission? Is the threat real? Yes, sir, we believe it is. Can you stop Perseus? We can, sir. I've already submitted the requisition for my team. Sir, their requests are highly irregular. Most likely illegal. If the press gets a hold... What the hell are you talking about? You know who we are? Every mission we go on is illegal. Sergeant Woods, plausible deniability is the backbone of our work. Al, we're talking about preventing an attack on the free men and women of the world. Give Mr. Adler whatever he wants. Gentlemen, you've been given an important task. Protecting our very way of life from a great evil. There is no higher duty. There is no higher honor. And while few people will know of your struggles, rest assured, the entire free world will benefit. I know you won't fail us. This is Hudson. How long until we have a lead on Perseus? They're about to get started. Adler's in West Berlin. He should be at the safe house soon. Do you trust him? <laughs> I'm not the one you should be asking, Black. What about his team? It's a strong group. He chased down Sims, Azalei, even pulled some strings to get Helen Park from MI6. We'll get them Mason and Woods soon. I'm not so sure about Park. She and Adler have that business from before. Of course he wants her there. And? The new one. Well, no, don't get me started. That's the one we need to keep our eyes on. Bell, welcome to West Berlin. We've got a job to do. Mark. Adler. Bell? Let's 
Let's get started. There's been a surge in Russian chatter in the last 48 hours. The CIA and the DOD have tapped their inside sources for anything substantial. So far, there are no leads on Perseus. MI6 has come up empty-handed as well. And we'll have to start somewhere. So we're going back here. Vietnam, 1968. One of our closest encounters with Perseus. Shit. Some part of me always knew that mission wasn't done with us. Pull up everything we've got on the attack in Da Nang and run it past Park. She'll cross-reference it with MI6. We're looking for code names, encrypted transmission, Russian activity with NVA, anything that could be a lead. You got it. Bell, this is where you come in. We needed the best of the CIA and SOG. That's exactly why I requested you again. Head to the evidence board. We'll retrace our steps through Da Nang. Anything that could give us a lead on Perseus. All right, Bell. We're going back to Vietnam. First time Perseus pinged our radar. It was late January 68. We were a joint CIA SOG task force embedded within the 3rd Marine Regiment near Da Nang. SOG was there to sniff out Soviet activity. Word had it, Russian operatives were active in the region. Perseus had no known presence in Vietnam. That changed at Da Nang. Somehow, Perseus knew about Operation Fracture Jaw. Fracture Jaw? That one sure went sideways. We launched out of Camp Haskins. Yeah, I'll never forget that shit. Good. We want those memories. No details too small. A face, a name. We're looking for anything that can lead us to Perseus. This feels like looking for a needle in a haystack, in a field of haystacks. Maybe, but that needle's somewhere. Remember, we have a job to do. Fractured jaw. That one sure went sideways. Bell, it's time to wake up. It's great time. Welcome to another day in the life of Camp Haskins, a little oasis in the middle of this godforsaken shitstorm. You're pretty safe here. Hey, Butcher! How's the arm? Still hurts like hell, but at least I can move it. Hey, Sims, you know reading that shit's gonna make you go blind. Yep. That's why I want it all up here. Bell, you're with Sims. You usually bring out the best in each other. We got a new assignment. FOB4 Ripcord is holding a vital asset Charlie wants real bad. What kind of asset are we talking about? The kind you don't ask about. Ripcord has been taking a hell of a beating. So it's our job to secure the asset and get the fuck out. Relax, we got fast flyers providing combat air support for this mission. It'll be a walk in the park. Headsets on. All birds check in when ready. Badger Niner 1, good to go. Badger Niner 2, clear to go. Badger Niner 3, rotors up. All birds, go, go, go. Crank up and pull pitch. All birds are in the air. You all sitting comfortably? Oh man, Adler? Why do I get the feeling you about to give us some bad news? Because you're a smart guy, Sims. But the news isn't bad. In fact, it could be very, very good. The asset of Ripcord is gonna have to wait a little while. We're breaking off from the Armada, taking a detour. And that's good because... A source tipped us off that there may be a heavy hitter in town. A Soviet operative known as Perseus. Oh, shit. Appreciate the enthusiasm, Sims. If our source is right, we could be looking at an Intel gold mine. First time Perseus pinged our radar. Approaching the village now. Yeah, roger that. Moving to a snap. 
establish an LZ. RPG! Talk to, line him up. There, in the bell tower. Bell, let's do this. It's on you, Bell. Open the door. Adler, we confirmed it. Soviets on site. You sure? Well, I'm staring at two bodies that sure as hell don't look Vietnamese to me. Bell, grab that comms log. Let's see who the fuck they've been talking to. Mission accomplished. We have the intel. Let's bug out. Good work. Hang on to that intel. We're coming in to pick you up. All right, let's go rejoin the Armada and get this fucking asset. Here. 
Perseus knew. Sims, Bell, you okay? We're okay. Bell, let loose with that goddamn turret before we're overrun.
Still with us? Think we can call this a success, Sims? <laughs> At least the nuke didn't go off. More importantly, we got intel on Perseus. Told you we had a job to do. It ain't done yet, not by a long way. Yo. How did the memory exercise go? Well, to hear it from Adler, it's working. Bell remembered finding that encrypted intel in Vietnam and has almost finished decoding it. Anything useful in there? Some names, apparently. Possible leads. Park is trying to connect the dots. We don't have much time. Does the team know about our mishap in Berlin yet? No, but if it's connected to one of those names from Bell, they'll find out soon enough. You won't let that happen, Hudson. Don't say anything more than necessary. That's never been a problem for me. We finished analyzing the names Bell acquired at Da Nang. One in particular stands out. Anton Volkov. He's a Russian arms dealer working out of East Berlin. Admittedly, his connection to Perseus comes as a surprise. We've got killer capture orders on Volkov. So if we can't get to Perseus, we'll get to his men. Close off his resources, force him out of hiding. Mason and Woods are still wrapping up business in Kiev. Which means Volkov is ours. Gear up, and we'll move out. MI6 has been tracking Volkov for several years. It is my strong preference that we attempt to capture, rather than kill him. He holds answers to a great many questions. Your preference has been noted, Agent Park. Volkov heads the Russian mob that moved into East Berlin once the wall went up in 61. This guy has connections to cartels throughout Europe and the Americas. Neutralizing him will not only hurt Perseus, but the global syndicate. He's a big fish. And here's our little fish, Franz Kraus. According to MI6, he's one of Volkov's information couriers. Here's a drop with Volkov scheduled for tomorrow night. We'll infiltrate East Berlin via the U-Bahn. The ghost station on the other side of the wall has the access point we need. From there, we'll watch Kraus as he enters the city. Once Falkov shows his face, it's killer capture. still patrol these abandoned stations. Patrol ahead. We can use a train to slip past. Take it slow. 
Arbeit und Führer waren. Ich suche über meinen Ausweis. Das ist Sperrgebiet. Sie sind verhaftet. Hund auf dem Boot. Hund, Now. Was zum... Nice work. Let's clean this up. Kraus should be coming through the checkpoint soon. Let's get to the rooftop. Park, Lazar, we're almost in position. Copy that. Come on, this way. Careful of the spotlight. Lock a place down, I'll give them that. Keep an eye on that checkpoint. Krauss will be coming through any time. Look for Krauss with your camera. Damn. Security's even tighter than usual. If they detained Kraus, he could miss his meeting with Volkov. Good job, that's our man. That's Kraus. On me. Park, Kraus just crossed the wall. What's your status? Lazar and I are at the exfil point, awaiting your arrival. Roger that. Our intel says Kraus and Volkov will meet at the bar across the street. Meet Hudson's contact inside. She'll have a blue umbrella. I'll stay out here and watch the street. Bell, the contact's waiting for you at the bar. Bell, look for the blue umbrella. Wie schön, dass Sie es geschafft haben. Kraus ist jetzt Table over my right shoulder. Guten Abend, mein Herr. Was darf ich Ihnen bringen? Eine Berliner Weiß. Audio is loud and clear. Now we wait for Volkov. Hudson didn't reveal much. He said you're after Volkov. Who knows? The man's like a ghost. I would guess no more than a day. Kraus is ex-Stasi, so don't let his wholesome appearance fool you. The man is a killer. One of my informants was picked up in a random sweep just two blocks from here. The Stasi must assume they are more nearby. I would ask a favor of you. He will not hold up under torture for long. We need him rescued. Or silenced. They're holding him here. Dankeschön. Heads up, Bell. I think Volkov is walking in. Who is Volkov? Bell, we've got trouble. 
there's two Stasi entering the bar. Get out of there, now! Jason, go through the bathroom. I'll hold them up. Team, new plan. Meet outside Krause's apartment. He's still our ticket to Volkov. I'm gonna need more time. Rally up with Lazar Park without me. I'll update you when I can. Ich bleib heute Nacht bei meinem Freund. Wir hatten ein paar zu viel in der Kneipe. Die beide. Schon gut, schon gut. Aber Sie können meine Wohnung von hier aus sehen. Ich frage nicht noch einmal. Careful, Bell. Oh, Stars here everywhere. Dass Sie hier drin sind. Ich tue Ihnen nichts. Ich möchte nur ein paar. F Weg. Vielen Dank. Ich bleibe, glaube ich, so lange hier, bis die Stasi weg ist. Bark, give me a zip rep. I'm in a storefront facing Kraft's apartment. He just got home. You? The Stasi are combing the area. I need to lay low. I'll catch up with you when the heat dies down. Bell, get to Park and Lazar ASAP. Out. I told you, I'm not who you think I am. You, I've seen your picture. They're looking for you. I've been monitoring a, a nearby KGB field house. I, I don't know how they found me. I, I've done everything by the book. What, what, what did that paper say? You, you can't trust these people. I don't even know what you're talking about. Please, just let me return to my children. Please don't kill me.
work. I don't think anyone saw you. Follow me. Stay quiet. We don't want the locals writing us out. Parks in the electronics store right across the street from Krauss's place. I was gonna pick her up some networks from the brown bar. Park is just up ahead. We're back. A car pulled up near Krauss's building a few minutes ago, but I didn't have a good angle to... Just a moment. Krauss is on the telephone. Bell, get eyes on Krauss. What do you think, Lazar? Sounds like Volkov wants Krauss's briefcase. We should place a tracker in it. The case will lead us straight to Volkov. One of us can sneak into Krauss's apartment. Avoiding Krauss and his wife might be the greater challenge. Bell volunteers. <clears throat> While he's doing that, I'll check around the exterior for any unwanted guests. Bart, you can keep an eye on us from here. I'll try to give you my best angles. Lovely. Hier gibt es keine Freya. Ja, das ist meine Nummer, aber ich fürchte, Sie haben sich... Hören Sie mal, ich weiß, dass Ihre Freundin nicht hier ist. Entweder hat sie Ihnen eine falsche Nummer gegeben, oder Sie haben sie... Edda, suchst du mir meinen Schirm? Ich gehe in ein paar Minuten. Ja, Franz, er ist hier im Wohnzimmer. Ich lege ihn neben die Tür. Mama, ich bin die kleine Deputy. Papa? Ich bin in ein paar Minuten oben, Wilhelm. Watch the Zähne. Come back up. Don't let Krauss see you. Just plant the tracker and get out of there. 
Then you let Perseus know I captured him. <sighs> Finally. Perseus has a large bounty on your head. I don't care about your questions. Unfortunately for you, it seems these friends of yours have other places to be, comrade. <laughs> I could probably make use of them, but you are damaged goods. Only a grave can cure a hunchback. That's not a good! You did the right thing. One of Perseus' men off the board. Is it? I wanted him alive. MI6 could have gotten so much more out of him. Can't win them all. Now let's get the hell out of East Berlin. The information from Volkov confirms our worst fears. Perseus smuggled a nuclear device through East Berlin. We can't be certain of that yet. He has it. I'm sure of it. We found encrypted geo-coordinates for Volkov's nuclear intel. An unpopulated region in the Soviet Republic of Ukraine. An aerial recon run revealed this. I want to know everything that's going on inside this building. We'll need the others for this one. Mason and Woods will join us from Kiev. Bell, you'll infill here with Woods. Mason and I will be standing by for an extract. Bark will handle comms. We have no idea how large or prepared their forces will be, so use discretion if you have to engage. It's time we took a peek behind the Iron Curtain. Mason and Adler on standby. Let's go. The base is just over the next ridge. Get in, 
Learn what you can, and get out. Shit, Park. We plan to stay a while. See the Gulag. Do that after we learn what Percy's at land. Look at that monster. Reds could be hiding anything inside. Snap a picture. Ops want to see this. Right. Time to get our hands dirty. I'm seeing guards. I am. Choose your target. That solves that problem. Take point and head down the slope. I'll hang back and cover. Snap pictures of anything that looks important. Maps, blueprints, whatever you can find. Move into the base. Find a way into the main building. I'll trail and disable the perimeter alarm. Нужно подкрепление. Got you covered. Shit. Patrols approaching my position. They'll find a way in. I'll follow around. Посторонний! Set. 
take the guards, Val. <laughs> All clear, moving up. Oh yeah, he found another sector. Shit, says this place was built as some kind of early warning system. Missile defense. Be ready. Be a thousand reds on the other side of this door. Cover me. Not a fucking word, Bell. The hell is this place? It's a Spetsnaz training course. Made to look like fucking any town USA. Oh shit, it's starting. Fuck, let's move! If they want a live fire drill, let's hook these fuckers up. run off to. Contact on the rooftops. There they are. Oh, Sacred. Bell, I'm picking up a ton of radio chat. What's your status? 
We got caught up in some kind of live fire drill. Place is crawling with reds. We're still looking for intel. Bloody hell. I'm putting Mason and Adler on standby for extract. She sounds mad. Does she sound mad? Looks like their command center. Come on. Jackpot. Computer central. Let's see what the Reds are really up to. Bell, hop on that terminal. Start poking around. Welcome to the Soviet People's Warfare Analysis Army. Operation Greenlight. Restricted access. What the fuck is Operation Greenlight? Bell, can you hack into that? Of course there's a password. Look around. These Reds ain't that smart. Maybe there's something on the desk. I don't know. Fuck, keep looking. Restricted access. Come on, Bell. You're supposed to be this master code breaker. Nice. We confirmed it. The nuke smuggled out of Berlin is a green light asset. It's one of ours. If that gets out, no one will know. Not even Adler's team. The stakes are too high. High is an understatement. We're talking about an American nuke hidden beneath Berlin. I want to make sure you're committed, Hudson. The play has been called. The ball's in motion. Well, if the asset learns the truth... You're worried about truth now? I'm concerned about control of the asset. If we can't control the asset, we end the asset. Game over. This doesn't make any sense. Percy's infiltrated a CIA nuke program, codenamed Operation Greenlight, run by Hudson. Stolen nuke is American, and Hudson fucking knew. Shit, time to go. I'm all right. I can't fucking believe it. Park, come in. Park, Hudson lied to us. He fucking lied to us. What? What are you talking about? I'm talking about green light. That's what Perseus is after, and Hudson has his fingerprints all over it. What's your breaking up? Just get the hell out of there! This went from bad to worse. Just make sure Adler and Mason are ready at the extra. Let's move! We've got to reach that exit. The bastards are blocking the exit. We're gonna have to punch through them.
sector. Looks like that concrete structure held a massive radar array. Yes, sir, I'm on it. You knew the nuke was from Greenlight, didn't tell us! What else are you hiding? Everybody stand down. This little pissing match isn't gonna help us catch Perseus. Why didn't you tell us it was an American nuke? He needed us to clean up his mess. The bastard's been lying to us all along. It's not a lie. It's an omission of fact. That's what you do best, isn't it, Hudson? Manipulate people. Tell them your own version of the truth. There is no truth. Only who you choose to believe. Adler knows all about that. Don't you, Russ? Operation Greenlight. What is it? Tell us everything. Back in 58, the arms race was in full swing. Eisenhower was convinced that the Reds moved on Europe. We couldn't respond quick enough. So he authorized Operation Greenlight, a top secret program that placed nuclear bombs in every major European city. The ultimate countermeasure to a Soviet invasion. 74 of the bombs were upgraded to high-yield neutron bombs, capable of terminating personnel without damaging infrastructure. Thousands dying in a flash. You're talking about fucking infrastructure. How's that for civilized? We kill the people but preserve the buildings. We're trying to preserve our way of life. How long have you known about the missing nuke? One of the Greenlight nukes went offline eight weeks ago. We suspected it was Perseus, but couldn't confirm it. So we saw the photos you brought back from East Berlin. So, there's an American-made nuke in the wild. And once Perseus detonates it, the United States becomes global enemy number one. We wouldn't have this problem if you'd done your job. Killed Perseus in Vietnam. Careful, Hudson. Next time, I might not stop Woods. Perseus is planning for that nuke. Park, anything else in that printout Bell and Woods pulled from the base? There's mention of an excavation taking place in the Ural Mountains, Yamantau. Our insider within the KGB confirmed an active operation. Yamantau? I thought Hudson and Weaver buried that place years ago. We did. Perseus wants to salvage the old mainframe. Dragovich and Steiner must have left some good shit behind. Steiner. Send me in Woods. You're too close to this, Mason. We were zero fuck-ups. Bullshit. You know there's no one better for the job. It's my call. I want Mason and Woods on this. Find that mainframe before Perseus does. I'll contact our KGB insider, Belikov. 
They'll offer logistical support. Hell, Belikov may want to fly the chopper himself. Whatever Perseus wants at Yamato, I want it more. The first building is just over that ridge. Thanks, Dimitri. We'll radio and we found the mainframe. Woods, you know what the KGB does to double agents. Yep. Duh. If they win this season, it's almost worth facing the fighting squad. Hey, I've only one hour of fuel. So after that, you find yourself a new ride. Come on, let's get moving, Mason. That's our inside man. Don't let the smell of cheap vodka and caviar throw you. Belikov is the real deal. Heads up. Scouts on the ridge line. We do this quiet, Mason. Yeah, you're the expert in quiet. Hey, I'm a complicated man. Good kill. Not bad. Let's keep moving. Take one fuck with, I'll get the other. Good kill. Hopefully nobody hurt. Shit, this looks dicey. Hey, get up the reds. You go first. This holds. See? Piece of cake. That's the old SATCOM building. Still standing after all these years. Barely. Let's keep moving. They got snipers. Don't let them spot you. Stay low. Keep out of sight. They're prepping the mainframe for extraction with a crane. We find the crane, we find the mainframe. Huh. Crossbow bolt. Looks like Hudson had some fun here. Yeah, that's not how he remembers it. Good thing I'm not afraid of heights. Soviet engineering in its worst.
That's the doomsday bunker. We're getting close to the mainframe room. We'll cross on that cable. Those reds in the helipad are gonna be a problem. We need to take them out first. I went first last time. Why change it up now? Whatever. Lost my damn gun. You're going first next time. I see a tunnel down here. You'll have to find another way inside. Copy that. Station. Woods. Great. Место было заброшено после схода лавины. Но я слышал, что при раскопках были найдены тела с пулевыми ранениями. Ты что, хочешь сказать, что наше начальство скрыло вражескую атаку на советской земле? Лавины не стреляют в людей. Я люблю случай. Нам пора идти. Ты что, боишься привидений? Я боюсь заблудиться и замерз нас насмерть, слушаю твои идиотские байки. Давай уже закругляться с обходом. В любом случае, разве здесь есть что-то важное? Не вижу ничего ценного. Close. Wonder what this opens. Открывай! Ну что, тебя? Я думал, он у тебя. Идиот! Как мы его откроем? Используй гранату, взорви его. Идиот! Мы рискуем. Что это было? Ты слышал? Контакт! Over here. With the ruckus you made, I'm surprised the entire Soviet Union ain't up our ass. You've been busy. That's what they pay me for. In here, Chief. Mason, hop on that scope. Look for something that could lift the mainframe. Steiner was working on all sorts of crazy shit. That Nova 6 business was just the tip of the iceberg. There, what's that? Bingo. That crane matches the dick site on this map. Have you found the mainframe? There's a big crane on the west side of the base. Have your winch ready. Excuse me? My, my winch? Sorry, you're breaking up. 
They get a crane, we got a chopper. Thing better hold this time. Woods, I am over the extraction site. Are you ready? We see you, Dimitri. Hold on. We're out of time. We have to jump. Mason! Mason, we gotta get down there, now! We must do contact! Is the mainframe big? Because if it's too big, we can't lift up. Mason, we gotta get down there, now! Uh, no! It's regular size! Take us up! Yeah, we'll be 
Hudson. We finished analyzing that mainframe that Mason Woods brought from Yamato. And? Perseus was looking for the names of sleeper agents Dragovich used in 68. Give us those names. We'll get Adler's team to track them down. Perseus erased them. Fuck me. There's only one place you're gonna find that information now. The Lubyanka building. What? KGB headquarters? Why didn't Perseus get them there himself? I don't know. Maybe he's operating without authorization. I'll let Adler know. But we're gonna do this the right way. We're not gonna do it anymore. Just got word. Belikov is back in Moscow. You guys know the plan. Bell, you with me. Lazar, be ready for Exfil. Are you taking him into the KGB with you? Are you crazy? Wait for Mason or Woods to return. I don't need Mason or Woods. I need Bell. He's got the skill we need. Are you enjoying this? You're risking the entire operation unnecessarily. Siri, it's calculated. Just understand that if you botch this, we can't get those names. It's over. I know you can do this. Hudson doesn't trust anyone he can't control. The Lubyanka building. KGB headquarters in Moscow. The sleeper agent records are stored in the archives 100 feet below ground in a nuclear defense command bunker. Your only way in or out is through this high-security elevator. We'll need proper credentials. That's where our asset, Belikov, comes into play. Belikov has been our source inside the KGB for nearly a decade. He'll get us in. He came through for us in Yamantown. He'll do it again. This shit is crazy, even by his standards. You sure he's on board? An immediate nuclear threat warrants every risk at this point. I'm sure he wouldn't disagree. Sims, get Belikov on the line. Алло, Беликов на трубке. Извините, я думал, что это песок с пол Сингапура. We're almost to the tunnels. Did you get access to the bunker? That's what I like to hear. Not yet. I know you have this under control. We'll meet you at the basement entrance once you have the bunker key. Kamna Belikov, you've been summoned to the conference room upstairs. Secretary Gorbachev is here from the Central Committee. I'm sorry. Comrade Belikov, have a seat. General Secretary Brezhnev has taken an interest in the new security development. There's a mole within the KGB. The committee wants someone from the first chief directorate to oversee Colonel Kravchenko's investigation. If you've not met him already, this is Imran Zakayev. Thank you, Secretary Gorbachev. And thank you all for welcoming me with open arms. I can think of no greater tragedy than a home violated from the inside. The trust and love within a family is sacred. Apparently. Not everyone shares your beautiful sentiments. Comrade Belikov, as head of security, I understand you've practically exhausted yourself in trying to unearth this mool. How is that gone? <clears throat> yes. And once we are finished with this mole, he will be as blind and buried as his namesake. <clears throat> Until the mole is found, I want security increased around the bunker. Zakayev, do you have any recommendations? We should restrict bunker access. We also want to cultivate closer relationships with all of you. I want to know your hopes, your fears, your ambitions. Be thorough, but we don't want any significant disruptions. And you, you Belikov? 
Who do you think should retain bunker access during the investigation? Comrade Belikov, my apologies. Even your bunker access has been revoked. We can't be too cautious, can we? Secretary Gorbachev, I believe it would be best if only General Charkov retains his bunker key for now. Very well. See to it. Worry yourself no longer, sir. I've already ordered the bunker keys collected from the men. Comrade Belikov, we are in grave danger from the capitalists. Our collective, our very way of life is at risk. <clears throat> the traitor will be caught. And he will pay a high price for his betrayal. Belikov, you are dismissed. <clears throat> I'm being watched. I need a bunker key. Now, first, I'll have to kill the cameras. Yes, I'll with in the kit. Sir. Now I need to hide the body. to get a bunker key for Adler. He'll need it to access the vault. Hmm. Unfortunately, Cherkov now has the only one. Where is Cherkov? What can I do for you, Comrade Belikov? The General will be questioning a prisoner today, but should be available most of the time. Just let me know when you're ready to meet with him. I have a chance to kill Cherkov. Kravchenko's office will have the poison I need. Attention, please. Andrei Morozov, this is 301. Milikov, have you dug up my mole yet? No matter. We've discovered additional unauthorized communications. Within hours, we will know the exact computer they came from. Comrade. Within hours, we will know the exact computer they came from. Comrade. Fuck. I will be exposed soon. In the server room, I could point evidence towards Cherkov.
Whoever you are, you won't get shit out of me. What? What does my family have to do with any of this? Yes, anything. Please, what do I need to do? Kill him. Uh, I'll try. But swear to this, my own life for my family. Bellicor, I just heard the most amusing thing. Let's chat once I'm finished here. Comrade, how's our friend doing? I don't know, sir. He doesn't have much to say. Oh, we'll see about that. Citizen Ivanov, I trust you're enjoying your accommodations. Yes, sir. Okay, now I need to head to the basement and let Adler's team in. You're really not going to say anything? How can I help you, sir? One. Our team will need uniforms to get past security. Luring two soldiers into the tunnel should do the trick. Bielica here. Send a security detail to meet me in the furnace room. Immediately! Wasn't sure you'd come through. I don't have much choice, do I? This keycard gives you elevated access to the bunker. What about uniforms? Shh, sounds like they're here now. Okay, I will lead them through and distract them. You two do the rest. Now, take cover. Keep it clean. Uniforms are no good to us, bloody. Я нашел незапертую дверь. Нету никакого оправдания этой некомпетентности. У нас есть очень строгие протоколы, чтобы это предотвратить. Понятно? Okay, I have to leave, but you should have everything you need. Now, if stopped, you are reporting to Commander Sobel. Get changed. Here, our weapons and key card are in the bag. This way. Once we're in the bunker, we're on our own. Ты слышал о генеральном секретаре Брежневе? Нет. Ну что случилось? Не мести на операцию. Товарищ, морщи отпустишь нас. Ладно. For us, we're going around. И куда это вы направляетесь? Досмотр обязателен для всех без исключения. Вы должны пройти досмотр. Товарищ, 
Доставьте вашу сумку сюда для досмотра. Пойдем, я нем кобиности. Дайте нам пройти. Не принимайте это близко к сердцу, товарищ. У меня приказ досматривать всех, без исключения. Товарищ, ты нужен за Кайву. Я разберусь. Спасибо, товарищ. После Вичи, Беликов. По-моему, я здесь, нет? Пойдем. Когда вы прибыли? Ах да, разумеется. Товарищ командир, я не расслышал. Кое совпадение? Я как раз к нему на прием. Обязательно передам ему привет от вас. Прежде чем Кравченко успел... Plant a gas canister in the bed. Good. Let's get to the vault. We're almost to the vault.
Don't have much time before they get through. There's the list bell. Copy it to a disc. Running out of time. You're almost through the door. Get ready. Here they come. Might be a way out. You are surrounded. We have your friend. Got Belikov. Time for Plan B, Bell. Activate the gas. Throw your weapons and surrender. Southwest courtyard in five minutes. Velikov is hitching a ride. Plenty of room in the backseat. 
Once we get off the elevator, just keep moving towards the courtyard. Get the charge ready, though. Let's go, Bell. for your call. They caused a hell of a mess in Moscow. Was it worth it? Adler managed to get the list of sleeper agent names, despite himself. He's got balls, I'll give him that. Bell did well. Seemingly. But I think that team is getting too comfortable. They're acting like they know who they're dealing with. Perhaps. Turns out, one of those sleeper agents is tied to Operation Greenlight. Theodore Hastings. He's a nuclear engineer based out of Salt Lake City. And you believe Hastings is the one he'll activate? Exactly. Total surveillance is already underway. It's only a matter of time before he leads us straight to Perseus. This is it. The recent movements of Theodore Hastings has led us here. Cuba. Right in our backyard. A vacant government facility in the Cuban countryside has become a hub of activity for Perseus, and the likely location of the stolen nuke. No doubt Castro allowed it. Twenty bucks to anyone who can bring him down before me. Who? Castro or Perseus? Whoever. We are not gonna let him move this nuke inside the States. It's time to take down Perseus once and for all. Team, wrap up any unfinished business. Once we strike, there's no turning back. Woods! Don't get any bright ideas over there. Yeah, you've got my sure as shit guarantee on you. What's up? I need a few minutes of your time to discuss something. You available? In private. You ready? Let's talk. You look ready. Yeah. Check this out. Hell yeah! That's it! You did- Alright. I'll let Mason and Woods know that we're ready. They'll be handling this one. Our source tells us that Aldrich is about to move south across Colorado and into northern New Mexico. That's where we'll intercept his convoy. We can't let a former CIA operative run a person's spy factory. Let's put this asshole six feet under. I can't believe Aldrich betrayed the CIA. Betrayed the whole fucking country. Phoenix 2-1, 30 seconds out. We're up, Mason. Locked and loaded. Target's ahead, taking the lead. Shitheads think they can hide from us. 
time to send a message. Lights. Aldrich is in one of those trucks. We hit the ground hot. Watch the runners. We'll cut off the lead truck. 2-1 for my overwatch. Let's go! Finished. Mason, let's get a picture of Aldrich for the CIA family photo album. For the traitor section. You know, the shitty part. <laughs> Got the photo. All right, let's get the fuck out of here. Taking heavy fire, waving off.
Okay. Woods and Mason are gonna take point on this. Apparently, Rudnik is lying low in a remote Soviet base in the mountains of Uzbekistan. Not remote enough. We're gonna land our boys nearby and pay him a little visit. Let's cut this Perseus sucker down to silence. Command sounded confident. Once we blow the shit out of their radio tower and create a distraction, we'll find out. It's time for a little hide and seek. All right, we're in position. Roger that. There's an airmail package ready for delivery. Just need an address. Go ahead and mark the radio tower for us. Basically, the tower's up above the far ridge. Coordinates coming your way. Roger. The check is in the mail. Now get down there and eliminate Rudnik before he escapes. We don't have a lot of time for this. Basically, take your line down. I'll have your back to here. Building clear. Rudnik isn't here. Go on and move to the next building. Vicious barrel. 
I got Rudnik. We need kill confirmation. Kill confirmed. We got the pick to prove it. Maybe next time we can draw pictures more than two. Evac chopper inbound. Pop some smoke to mark your location. Smoke out! Chopper's just a few minutes out. Mason, we have air support on standby. Hastings left Salt Lake City. We tracked his movements all the way to Cuba. We have to assume Perseus moved the nuke there. Langley believes Castro could help Perseus smuggle it into the U.S. In exchange for a peek at the hardware, of course. That isn't gonna happen. What's the plan? The last read we have on Hastings came from 30 miles south of Havana. We suspect Perseus is using an abandoned compound there to hold the nuke. They're working under the radar, so expect moderate security. I say we smash and grab. Parachute in, grab the nuke, sky hook out. And what if the nuke isn't there? It's there. The only reason Perseus needs Hastings in Cuba is to prepare it for arming and detonation. There you have it. Hudson will arrange our exfil while we're en route. If everyone's... Adler's late. No, love. We're early. Adler should be checking in right about... Park, we're in position. Copy that. We're moving to flank. Fast and loud. Find Hastings, grab the nuke, get the hell out. Woods, light up this joint. About fucking time. Go, go, go! Do the honors, Bill. Let's go. It's like fucking clockwork. Catch the cover! All teams fan out. Defense to the main gate.
que arriben a la puerta principal. Asegúrense de la They've got closed circuit cameras. We could use them to locate the nuclear bomb. Sharp as ever, Pork. Spread out. Find that nuke. Contact. Fuck. Is everyone all right? Bell, sweep for mines. What do you say we finally grab that drink when this is over? Your persistence is admirable, Lazar. <laughs> That's not a no. Jesus, get a fucking room, you two. Mason, you missed one behind the counter. Thanks, Park. Keep looking. There. Hold it. Adler, we have eyes on the nuclear device. Bloody hell. Someone's killing the scientists. Where? Second floor. Room 27B. Second floor, center room. Upstairs. Look Let's move. Get you there, Park. Crude, but effective. Can't keep your eyes off me, huh, Park? Bell, use the C4. Adler, we're moving to the second floor. We're pinned down. Move ahead. We'll catch up. Inside. Bell canvassed the room. 
Hastings, start talking. <clears throat> Perseus was here. <coughs> he shot us. Escaped. Perseus would never leave his precious nuke behind. He forced us to reverse engineer the detonation codes. They'd give him full access to green light. What? Are you telling me Perseus can detonate multiple nukes in Europe? I'm so sorry. Hastings, stay with us. How many green light devices can Perseus detonate with those codes? He can detonate all of them. He'll wipe out half of Europe. And blame it all on the USA. We need to find that son of a bitch, Perseus. Time to go. Find no contact. Gun. Chopper coming in low. It's gotta be Perseus. All teams head to the roof. Move, move. And we get a shit Cover ton me. of reinforcement circling. Oh. Finding cover. Damn it, Doris. Clear. Out of the way. <laughs> Adler, I got eyes on an HVT. South rooftop. Could be Perseus. He's climbing into a chopper. Lock it down. Wind out the window. Bell, let's go. Oh, it's me. The chopper got away. Fuck Perseus. We got bigger problems. Lock down. Don't wait for us. This is ground team. For Bring you a visual. Roger that ground team. We have visual. Fasten your harness, cross your arms, and remember to keep your backs to the wind. Inbound in two minutes. Man down! Heads up, Mark. You got snipers on the roof. Copy that. Take out those snipers. They're everywhere. Go first, Lazar. We're low on ammo. You know what, Lazar? I think I'm ready for that drink now. Don't tease me, Park. But we'll have none of that horse piss you Fuego call beer. You'll be a proper drunk. Get ready. Here they come. Getting low on ammo. Where's that plane? One minute. Stay focused, Lisa. I'll tell you what. When we get out of this, I'm fine. Now that's something worth fighting. Ground team, this is Skyhook. He's on his hot as hell. Can we lend an assist? That will be much appreciated, Skyhook. Skyhook. I can see the plane. Mark, we need to hook into the line now. We'll do it in turns. Bell, you harness up first. We'll cover. Go. Take cover. Shit. My legs! Contact in T I minus ten. Nine. The harness. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. a goddamn fiasco. You go in with the intel you have, not the intel you want. We paid the fucking piper down there. You think this is Bell's fault? I don't know whose fault it is. I just know that Perseus doesn't have a single fucking nuke. He's got dozens. Millions of people are gonna die, and the United States will take the blame. You need to 
find out where he's planning to broadcast the activation signal. How are we gonna pull that out of our ass? Bell knows where it is. Bell? This goddamn science project was a failure! Don't count Adler out yet. The man has a deep bag of tricks. Come on, a little further. He's coming too. Bell, no more fucking around. What did Perseus say? Where is he? What you're going through now is nothing compared to what you'll experience if you don't start cooperating. We gave you a second chance when you were shit out of luck. Now, we just want some assistance in return. Bell, you were one of Perseus's agents. His associate, Arash Kardavar, turned on you at the airstrip in Turkey. Left you for dead. When the plane leaves trap zone, he's stopping in Duva. This you know. Here's what you don't know. Perseus won't be there. None of these hired guns are going to leave Duva alive. We'll dump their bodies in the forest. Then we will move the weapons to Volkov in Berlin. From there, we fly to Solovetsky. But I have other plans for you. Perseus thinks too highly of you. I don't want the competition. We were there. We found you after everything went down. The CIA reinvented you, Bell. We needed to give you a new identity to replace the old. Sims and I both wanted you to be CIA. You didn't resist it as much as we thought you might. And we were able to utilize your language and cryptography skills as an added bonus. The bigger challenge was your memory. The CIA's MK Ultra program used Atlas missions in Vietnam as a template. We needed you to have that shared experience, that lifelong bond, to establish trust. No. Count yourself lucky. You've only had those memories for a few months. Me? I've been living with them for over a decade. Interrogation didn't work with you, but thanks to MK Ultra's research, we had a backup plan. If you believed you were someone else, we could lead you to a place where you'd give everything up. Enough to get us where we are today, but we're not finished yet. We have a job to do. Bell, we've got come a job. on, we've got a job to do. You've got a job to do. You've got a job to do. The trigger phrase kept you in line, but it didn't get us everything we needed. Your innermost secrets were always locked behind a door. Bell, I realize you probably hate us right now, what we've done to you. I just need you to fully understand the stakes here. What you do right now is not about me, it's not about you, it's about millions of other fucking people. It's about stopping someone who, in the end, has no true allegiance to anyone other than himself. So tell me, where is Perseus? Once we control the Greenlight Arsenal, we will detonate them all from the safety of Solovetsky. From the safety of Solovetsky. This is your chance to define who you really are, Bell. Where is Perseus? From the safety of Solovetsky. Duga. Sims, get Washington on the line. 
Everyone else, gear up. We're leaving now. You made the right choice, Bell. Come on. You're still one of us. Adler. Right. Yeah. We'll leave within the hour. Five years ago, NATO intelligence detected a powerful signal of unknown origin. The new signal created radio disruptions worldwide. Not to mention all kinds of conspiracy theories. NATO quickly tracked it to this facility in the Soviet Republic of Ukraine, the Duga Radar Array. It's an over-the-horizon radar system. Big improvement over their old missile defense tech. It uses a lot of juice. Could be used to broadcast any kind of long-range signal they want. Like detonation codes to every green light nuke in Europe. Where exactly is this thing? About 60 miles north of Kiev. Between the cities of Pripyat and Chernobyl. It's nothing but thick forest for miles around. A perfect hiding spot for Perseus. We'll have to drop you in a little further out. No recon, no heavy support. Just a light infiltration squad. Shouldn't be a problem. Just point the way. Bell came through for us in the nick of time. I never doubted it. Adler. Still seeing no activity from our side. Same. I haven't seen shit. All right. Everyone converge on the gate. You sure you're not forgetting something, Bell? There's nothing here. This can't be the right place. We ain't seen anything on our side either. It's him! He fucking lied to us! That true, Bell? You pull us out to the middle of nowhere Russia so Perseus can detonate those nukes? becomes the mouse. Glad to see you still care. Mind giving me a light? Huh? <laughs> 
That street dog should have been put down long ago. You remember my face, don't you? Solovetsky, stand by for the detonation order. I think you deserve this moment, comrade. I wish we could return to Solovetsky to watch it all unfold, but that chapter is closed now. We begin the next one together. You did well. And to think, after all this time, they still believe I'm Perseus. <laughs> As if Perseus could ever be an individual working alone. So American. Ah. We'll need a new home now. The Central Committee will be more surprised than the CIA. Even if we made the best choice for the future of our homeland. Mm, yet, for humanity, their eyes will be as clouded as ours once were. Come. There is still much to be done. Green light nukes did he detonate? All of them, Mr. President. Does anyone know the bombs were ours? Materials related to Operation Greenlight were anonymously released an hour ago, presumably by Perseus. Calls are beginning to come in from across the globe. That son of a bitch. You and Vice President Bush are to be moved to secure locations immediately. I want any business related to this thing erased forever. Everything. Can you make that happen? Of course. It's already begun. We will watch Europe burn. We will watch the Empire of the United States collapse under its own weight. A world with two superpowers will become a world with one. The Soviet Union. And if the leaders of this new world order squander the opportunity we have provided them, then they too will be replaced.